the Texas shooter, Devin Patrick Kelly, served in the Air Force for four years until he was dishonorably discharged for assaulting his wife and child from Axios. The suspect was Devin Patrick Kelly, 26, a Texas resident who served in the Air Force from 2010 to 2014, left with a bad conduct discharge and was sentenced to a year's confinement for assaulting his wife and child, an Air Force spokesperson told the LA Times. Kelly was killed after a brief chase, though it was unclear how he died. Kelly had been dressed in black and wearing tactical gear. He used a Ruger AR-15, similar to a military rifle. President Trump addressed the shooting from Japan, our thoughts and prayers are with the victims and families of today's attack. We cannot put into words the pain and grief we all feel and we cannot begin to imagine the suffering of those who lost the ones they so love. The details, per officials. At 11.20 a.m., the suspect was spotted at a gas station near the church. Shortly after, he crossed the street to the church and began shooting at it. He then moved to the right side of the church and kept shooting, before entering the church to open fire. When he exited the church, a local man engaged the suspect at which point the suspect dropped his weapon and fled. There were about 20 wounded with injuries ranging from minor to critical. Sutherland Springs is a small town in South Texas, about 35 miles east of San Antonio. Parishioners present at the First Baptist Church's 11 a.m. service Sunday morning when the shooter attacked were likely all members of Sutherland Springs' small community of well under 1,000 people. The church's pastor told ABC that his 14-year-old daughter, a very beautiful, special child, was among those killed. Helicopters arrived on the scene shortly after the shooting occurred to transport victims to local hospitals. The local community center has been turned into a resource center for families of the victims to wait for information as authorities are still treating the church as an active crime scene. This was the worst church shooting in U.S. history and the deadliest mass shooting in Texas's history.